I'm Sarah Hill and I'm a director of Opus Independence Limited and we do a number of things really. Uh, the, most, the one we're most famous for is uh, Now Then magazine. Uh, it's our fifth birthday this month actually. I'm wearing a t-shirt for Now Then in shameless like self-promotion. <laughs> um, <laughs> but it's, uh, it's a monthly magazine. Uh, I suppose broadly you call it an arts and culture and politics magazine, um, but we, it's citizen journalism, that's the key, so really we cover anything. If anyone wants to write for us, then they can write for us and send it in to our editor, sam at nowthenmagazine.com, uh, and we'll look at it, and if it's well researched and it's well written, then we'll publish it, because it's, the idea is the magazine is a platform for people who have got something to say to be able to say it. And it's a platform that's not uh, taken over by corporate interests, it's a platform that's completely independent, completely open and accessible, at least that's what we hope, that's what we're aiming for. Um, it's free to pick up all around Sheffield. This is our latest edition. Uh, we have a different artist who comes in every month, so every month we portfolio the work of a different artist. This is Flem. He is a Sheffield institution. He is a god in Sheffield. <laughs> like, he did our very first edition, so we're so proud to have him back in for our fifth birthday edition. That's been lovely. Um, and the magazine's supported by advertising, um, but we only take adverts from independent businesses or arts institutions, local governments, and so no chains, no corporations, no Tesco, nothing like that. It's really about independent Sheffield and creative Sheffield coming together and, and having a platform that's free and open to everybody.